What is up, YouTubers? This is Ginger Snap here, and I am here on Elder Scrolls Online. I'm loving this game. It is one of my favorites. Um, honestly, like, they took Skyrim, made it multiplayer. I mean, it's, it's pretty darn close to Skyrim. Like, there's a lot of things. There's different things. And I just really enjoy it, guys. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, today we're actually doing the main quest instead of like the side quest that I've done done the past two videos. Um, and uh, so yeah, so let's go do that right now. Um, we're going this way. Act. Oh wait, wait. No, actually, we're gonna do one more thing. One little side quest before we go. This one, this tears one. We're gonna do this real quick here. No, it's not inside here. It's around this building. That's a really cool mount, actually. Or pet, I guess. Alright, here we go. Uh, ask the bartender about distracting the. What am I supposed to take first so I know? Okay. Greetings, stranger. Long have you eaten yet? The long. Pardon me, I'm. He's a crank. We're releasing a rat in the bar. Releasing a bat in the bar. Damn rats. I hate them. You know I like when Valen sings. <laughs> that didn't work. Let's try again. Oh, it swapped it out. Oh, sweet. And I just gotta take this back to, to the other person before I get caught. I don't think I can get caught, but you know. Ooh, can I set stuff to Q? Hello there. Sorry, I just gotta check this out real quick, guys. I got a diamond. What? Hmm. Cool. Um. Bone splitter. Nice. All right. Um. No, but I wanted to know all my skills. Can I set this? to Q. Let me do I said where is it? Not this one. Dark magic. Um No. Okay, fine. Soul magic? Oh, soul trap. Mage skill. Meteor? 
Uh, yeah. I'd say that's it's really cool. Okay, anyway. <sighs> Where am I taking this? I'm taking this to the guy over... Where'd he go? There he is. Running like a maniac. Look at this run, like, like seriously. Like, I had never run that fast. Unless, like, there was ice cream or something. Do uh, I detect the bouquet? Please oh. bless. Yeah, yeah. Alright, fine in that area. We gotta go through here. I don't know where he wants me to go. Oh, there. Let's put an F here. Alright, where's my, um... Okay, I got both of those guys with me. Let's go. I'm actually, I've never, I've, I've never really used, um, a staff. What I want to know before I head on out is... One, wait. One... Stop switching my thing. First thing, I need to quickly go to this bank real quick. I need to drop off some of my crafting things and things like that. And then after that, we're heading off on our little adventure. Alright. That snake. Okay, watch this, guys. Loading time. It's out instantaneously. Like, what is this even? I can assure Bank. I want really take it from me. No. I just take clicked the wrong me. one. Store. We'll do that. We'll keep that. And we'll keep the leggings. Weapons. Uh we'll deposit the bone splitter because I don't have deposit that. Oh, wrong one. There you go. Apparel. Well, I'll probably deposit. Offhand, offhand. go we are emptied we are ready so I can pick up whatever I want to pick up let's go guys we got this it's ridiculous stay alert although I don't like traveling in the night I think it's about to be night I don't know if they have nights 
probably. Oh dear. That was a sip of health. <laughs> a sip of health. You can have a sip of health. the wrong button again. It's freaking getting on my nerves. Oh, um, that's what I was wondering. I didn't mean to do that again. Alright, for this, my character. Uh, for weapons. Features utilities, maybe no, upgrades. No, not character slots. I thought you needed. Weapon swap set to one and two. There it is. I unlock it at fifteen. Okay, that's fine. As long as I unlock it eventually. All right, so that's that's also our goal, guys. Is 15. I think I have to go up through this area. I don't know if I'm going the right way, guys. Oh, I am. Not. I don't know, guys. Let's go up here. What I like is this. Who is that? 
Well, okay. That was awesome. That was really cool, guys. I even leveled up from that. That was really cool. What I get from that, anyway. Um, I got this, which that's pretty nice. Cuss. Alright, you know, for the time being, let's do quick slot stuff. Um, and this one I'll put in the top, this one I'll put to the right, this one I'll put here, and then we'll do the treasure map here. And we're gonna actually set my quick slots to quick slot item. What? Oh, that's what Q is. Sweet. Oh, there's the door. Oh, it's down there. Okay, it's fine too. Alright, that's a good guy. I'm surprised I didn't take any damage from that at all. someone want to join me? Nope. Solo, I guess. What's the purpose of being a virtual strength? Some quick piece is just made him leave him blind and almost feeble. Oh my goodness. <sighs> I'm going to let this video go till 30 minutes because I want to finish this quest. So, this video will go till I finish this quest, because I haven't given you guys enough to view. Because, like, it's just like a little something. I'll grab everything in the world. Because I'm. What the? You have a whole setup here, dude. What is that? Ah, oh, what is that? Low profit. Despite my blindness, nay, because of it, my other senses seem to have heightened. This place had the right smell about it. Indeed, but not of a sort. I enter my mind, Vestige, and walk mm. with me through the shadows of past events. Let's enter his mind and walk with him. I'm expecting a really cool uh, cinematic here. Well, what did you know? We're walking with him now, and we can still attack, which makes me believe. Follow me, Vestige, and learn of the events Welcome. that precipitated our current crisis. Okay, we're learning. This is a history lesson, guys. I wish school was like this all My the time. The story began when I awoke on the steps of the Abbey of the Moth Priests. With no memory of my prior life. Well, that sucks, and I don't want The moth there priests bad guy back took there? pity upon me. Oops. And brought me into their fold. Oh. I was weak and near death. Really? That's not good. I'm glad that they brought you into their fold. But, um. It was there I first set eyes upon the Elder Scrolls. <gasps> I my life to their school. Elder Scrolls. Okay. Oh! <gasps> He has an Elder Scroll inside his brain. allowed me to glimpse the very fabric of reality. But each profound insight dimmed my vision and eventually left me permanently blinded to the light of the world. But not the Elder Scrolls, right? Oh, come on! Should've let me touch it. Okay, I'm walking, I'm walking. The prophecies of the Elder Scrolls are a fluid living thing. They are not fixed. At many points throughout history, the actions of heroic mortals have rewritten them. Okay, so what does that have to do with me, bro? I only know that you are important, Vestige. The scrolls reveal to me that your destiny is intertwined with that of... Uh -huh. Five companions were a band of adventurers who sought out an ancient artifact called the Amulet of Kings. 
They hope to use this artifact to persuade Akatosh, the Dragon God, to accept their leader as one of the Dragonborn. Dragonborn? The Dragonborn are mortals, mortals designed for great destiny. With great name, I'm not going to do that. Veins. It is said that only a true Dragonborn can ignite the eternal dragon's fire in the Emerald City. I mean, Emerald. Imperial. Imperial, not Emerald. Sorry. Who was the lead? That's the leader. Aquilarius, the son of Go on. You have already heard enough babbling from this old blind yep. fool. It is time you. I guess I keep walking. The okay. first companion, Lyris Titanborn, daughter of giants, oh, the mightiest warrior in the service of the Empire. Next, Abna Farm, a powerful sorcerer, and Grand Chancellor to the Imperial Elder Council. Oh. The Red Guard Swordmaster, Sai Sahan, leader of the Imperial Dragon Guard. The Imperial Emperor, Baron Aquilarius. Who attempted to light the dragon fires and failed. And finally, Manam Marco, the traitor, the king of worms, <laughs> a powerful necromancer, and your execution. <gasps> he killed me? Can I go kill him now? What? You a jerk? Come here. I don't know what I'm doing, like praying over her. Uh, uh, uh. May you die, 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 may you die. Yeah, anyway. Um, continue, Prophet. These were the five companions who set out from the. Many Marco convinced Baron that the amulet could be used to perform a ritual that would rekindle the dragon fires. He claimed this would please Akatosh. And entice him to adopt Verin as one of the Dragonborn. By tradition, only the Dragonborn can lay claim to the Ruby Throne and rule as the one true Emperor by divine right. Mm. Verin conquered Cyrodiil and took the throne, but unless he became Dragonborn, he feared he'd always be thought of as a pretender. Oh no. Nuh uh. Each of the five companions were chosen for their skill and courage. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna talk to you about more things. These were the five. Nope. Sorry, wrong button. These were the five. Many Marco. By tradition, only the. Manamarco. Each of the five companions. The fan. Manamarco. The disaster, war, and pestilence. A world war. Mm hmm? Now we're gonna go watch them? Do what? Oh. There it is. The dragon fire brazier. Oh. Manimarco, are you certain this will work? It will work, my liege. The amulet of kings will rekindle the dragon fires and ensure your rightful place as emperor. You have my word. It better work, Manimarco, or you'll find your neck at the business end of my axe. My lord, I wonder if you'd muzzle your half giant pet. She really is annoying. Enough, both of you. We are here to ensure my lord's rightful claim to the ruby throne. Amna, begin the ritual. I have a destiny to fulfill. By the lighting of the dragon fires, I claim my rightful lineage. By the fires of creation, let me be reborn. By the will of Akatosh, I proclaim myself dragonborn. For your sacrilege, the veil between Tamriel and Oblivion tears and splits asunder. What's happening? The sky is opening up. This is bad. This is very bad. Well, 
Wait, does that mean I was that other guy? Does that mean I... Because he said he killed me, so... Who am I? The ritual tore the veil between Nairn and Oblivion, allowing Menomarco to begin stealing the souls his master needed to power the Dark Anchors and initiate the Plane Mill. Akatosh gave Alessia the Amulet of Kings as a symbol of his covenant with Nairn. So long as the amulet remained in the care of Alessia's heirs and the dragon fires remained lit, Tamria would be protected from the Daedra. Manamarco tricked Varen into breaking the covenant, and the veil between Oblivion and Nern was torn. The Elder Scrolls named this event the Soul Burst. It gave Molog Baal the opportunity to disconnect the souls of Nern from their hosts. Varen was lost. In the chaos of the moment, Sai Sahan took the Amulet of Kings and fled. Leris was captured by Menamarco and delivered to Cold Harbor, the realm of Molog Baal. Tharn remains Chancellor of the Elder Council, and his daughter Clivio rules as Empress Regent. But the true power remains in the hands of Manimarco and his worm cult. When I discovered the truth about the five companions, I made subtle inquiries, but apparently not subtle enough. Manimarco got word of my interest and abducted me. He took me to Cold Harbor, where I remained a prisoner until you freed me. The truth is always a threat to evil men. Manamarco feared I would reveal his treachery, and if knowledge of Nan's vulnerability were to become known, it could threaten. I'm sorry guys, this guy is, like loves to talk and we gotta walk with him and watch ago, things. Written, this is not that so fun. As long as the amulet of kings was born by Alessia's heirs, Tamriel would be protected from the forces of oblivion. I mean it's cool, but so I'm sure it's not fun to watch. So if you guys worlds, stop watching no this video, I understand. Merlock Bowles, dark anchors pierce the two of them and seek to draw Nern into the depths of Cold Harbor. These terrible engines of destruction are appearing all throughout Tamriel. Uh, that's not cool. survive the ordeal, and those that do will be enslaved for all eternity. And so it falls to us, Vistage. We must, as you say. That was fun. And so it begins. The remainder of the story has yet to be written. It is your story now. And there is so much to do. We must grow in strength and in numbers. You will need more than the company of an old blind man to alter the course of history. We must assemble our own group of companions. The first you have already met. Lyris sacrificed her own freedom to allow us to escape. She remains a prisoner. Minamarco's agents leave a web of lies and deceit. They pit the races of Tamriel against one another and divert their attention from the real threat. Seek out these agents wherever they can be found, and expose their lies. Forgive me. Bringing you to my mind seems to have taken quite a toll on me. I must rest. <laughs> Leave me now. I must rest. Okay. So... That's it? That's it's that's it. That's all she wrote, guys. Sorry, I thought I was gonna be going on some sweet, awesome kick fighting adventure, and turns out that it wasn't as sweet and awesome of kick fighting adventure. So yeah. Sorry about that. Hmm. Well. Um, hmm. <laughs> uh, 
I mean, for... Well, I apologize for that, guys. Um, I hope you guys did like this video. Uh, if you did, leave a like. If you didn't, leave a dislike. Comment down below on what you want to see. If you guys want to see something different than what I've shown you all recently, uh, if uh, you want to, uh, you know, anything, just just let me know. Uh, I'm, I'm more than welcome to uh, uh, try to check out new things and and. Uh, a do different quests for you guys so uh hope hopefully we can get into some more action in the next video um i'll actually post it in the title or something be like and we have action or something and finally fighting or something um so i'll see you guys later thanks for watching bye everybody